Hey guys, welcome back to Yoshi's Crafted World on the Switch. Look at our purple Yoshi still wearing his squash costume from last time in the Origami Gardens. But let us be the regular Yoshi. I think it's time for him. And we have to choose a path. If you remember last time, we unlocked two potential paths forward. And there's three gems that were shown to us that we could go chase after. So if we bring up the map, we could see... The yellow one down there in the water, or the red one. The red one has a cheaper path, but that bottom one looks kind of tasty. I see a giant cupcake. And you know what that means. Two pastel pathway. Yes, is this where we get the cupcake costume? I'm wiped out, 15 smiley flowers. I want that pink cupcake costume that I've seen in the trailers. That was really hard to get out. I don't know why I stumbled on my words. Thanks, that really puts a spring in my step. Well, spring- Look at that cupcake, dude! If it wasn't made out of buttons and fabric, I would eat it. I see a windmill. Welcome to Pastel Pathway. Stitched together. What is this, Woolly World all of a sudden? I approve. Woolly World was a fantastic game. Stitched together. I don't know, the last world was pretty good. I liked the origami gardens. Yoshi, all right, we got some more somersaulting Shy Guys. Oh, they brought back this mechanic from Woolly World, pushing the little whatever that is. Okay. I see yarn balls and a giant snow mountain, if that is snow. Yeah, they brought back this stuff too. Uh, the what are these called? Mobiles. Mobile. However you say it when you're talking about it in terms of a thing that hangs over a baby bed. A new song. It's still very babyish, but... At least it's not like that one level. That one level had terrible music. This one, it's subtle in the background. I can deal with it. Eat it! Is there a hidden cloud? Nope. I forgot to put a costume on Green Yoshi, but you know what? That's fine. What do we do here? Okay. They're gonna hide something in one of these. I can feel it. Whoa! That was almost instantaneous. I wasn't expecting it to be. I was. I see a cloud hiding behind that thing. Don't act like I didn't see it. Look at its wings, how they flap so. Hearts. Definitely need them. I don't have a costume to protect me. Um, gotta stand on this for you. Yeah, I thought you could hide from me, eh? What is that? Oh my gosh, it's a shy guy in a cardboard. <laughs> That's awesome. What did that? Oh, get him! No, oh, I accidentally started to throw an egg. I didn't mean to do that. All right, what's this one do? Same thing? Ah, I missed a coin. That's okay. We'll go back and get it. Red coin? No red coin. Yeah, I like this song, actually. It does slightly remind me of the Woolly World music that also featured baby mobiles. Mobiles, whatever. I, I don't like that word, because I don't know how to say it. Because you could say it all kinds of ways. Dusty! Come here! Yum. Yes, he makes an egg. That wasn't always the case. Somet I think it wasn't at Yoshi's Island. He just swallowed Gusties and no egg was born. Yes, first flower. Out of six. I almost bonked my head on him. Oh, this guy again. I'm gonna stomp him. Ah! Whoa! I couldn't break out of that back foot. That I I died. Okay. I lost all my eggs, but it doesn't That's interesting. That's almost like a mellow mode thing. But this isn't mellow mode because you you could tell because Yoshi doesn't have wings. I've been in standard mode the whole time. I see a guy hiding. Well, we gotta get some hearts to make up for that. That was crazy, the knockback. <laughs> That was one tough shy guy. It's that cardboard armor. You cannot 
underestimated. Gotcha, finally. I was trying to ricochet an egg, but apparently that doesn't really work in this game, unless I'm just doing it really wrong. Yeah! What is that? Oh, okay. If you've never played Yoshi's Woolly World, though, you should really check it out. Whoa, I didn't expect to go in there. I was just kind of... Okay. I will take it. I mean, you could even tell in that game, in my Let's Play of it that I did, I was like so happy the entire time. And a lot of it was due to the music, I think. Because not only was it an adorable game, but you were dancing the whole way. <laughs> well, sort of dancing. Yeah. Because for those of you who don't know, Tomoya Tomita is also one of the guys who's been behind music for Castlevania games and Mystical Ninja, Goemon, as he's called. And those games are notorious for their good music. Or, yeah, however you properly word that sentence. There's definitely something over here. Let's get the angle right. Alright, I guess we just go under. Yeah, they haven't missed one, okay. I don't know, lately it's like... It seems I missed one of the flowers. I'm definitely liking this a lot more though. Even though I was just talking about Woolly World and stuff. Uh, okay, gotta move. I don't know, you could tell they've definitely stepped up the level design here and the challenges embedded within it. That it's feeling more like the Yoshi game I know and love so much. Yeah! I could just be getting used to the mechanics too. And forgiving whatever it doesn't feel like. <laughs> I don't know. I imagine, though, if the soundtrack was composed by Tomoya Tomita and was as great as the Woolly World ones were, it would be that much more likable. But I don't want to gripe about the music every episode. This reminds me of Woolly World, though. You would hit the background one to form a new platform made out of yarn. But we don't have yarn balls, so that's not going to work, is it? But I have to check. Nope, you can't even highlight it. This is interesting though, it makes me wonder when in the development process was this particular stage designed. Hey, a secret passage. And a thing, there's something back here. Yeah. Doing good! I don't know, I think... I, I want to say that this was probably an early developed stage just because of the yarn. Coming off of Woolly World. But who knows, maybe they already knew what they were doing and they developed this one last and were like, why don't we just have a nice nod back to our previous game. Oh jeez, oh man, that was close. He almost landed right on me. All right, Piranha Plant, what happens if, oh, not you, you, you were evil last time. I'm ready for you this time. Yeah! Three coins, well, two for me. The one went tumbling off the cliff, wait. That one thing looked very suspicious. What is with that plaid? That almost looks like a pushable thing or something that you could just walk through. Must get the angle right and check. No, it's just fabric. Okay.
Yeah, I would say this is the best song so far. I mean, compared to what it's... What the other stuff we've heard so far. And what atmosphere it's meant to be suited for, or paired well with, or... Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't speak, apparently. Is there anything in that huge space besides death? Let's go, shy guy. Yeah. Okay, now there's definitely something over this way. Whoa, whoa. Okay, let's just go. Flutter those feet, Yoshi. Yes. One flower to go. 392 coins already in this stage? Uh-oh, we're gonna flip something. Get ready. Uh, the green guy. Okay, he's over there. Now he's over on the left. Where on the left? It was like one of these clouds. There are no egg refillers. I see a propeller. It is him. Okay, good. Whoa! Good job, Yoshi. Two eggs to spare. And we got max hearts. Let's not take a hit. Like that cardboard shy guy. Oh, man. Gusty almost snuck up on me. Oh, that was close. Watch out. Man, remember the special stages of Woolly World 2? Those were amazing. Yeah, right, okay. I'm getting in the hang a little bit of how to aim without moving Yoshi. What the heck? You can't do that, Gusty. I know I've gobbled you many a time. Oh, watch there not be hearts. See? That's what I get. That's my penalty for not utilizing the new costumes. Unless this is hearts, please be hearts. Oh, wait. That's good, too. Yeah, last red coin. Yeah, how much you want to bet we're right here at the end? Yep. Lesson learned, kids. Utilize the costumes. Because you never know when a trio of gusties is going to come flying up behind you and rob you of your heart reward. Yep, had I had a costume, I would have had 20 hearts. Otherwise, 100%. It was a nice level, I liked it. Decent, decent-ish music. Cupcake! It's time for the giant cupcake stage. Yes. Oh, the costumes are way over there. I want to be a cupcake. Um, let's check it out. Poochie, sweet run. Yes. Poochie and cupcakes? The cupcake level, or the cookie level, rather, of Woolly World was amazing. When everything was just ice cream sandwiches and cookies. I expect good things. Caramel dudes, eat them. Oh, yeah, look at how... Oh, man, don't you just want to bite into it, even though it's a spring? Look at this chubby dude. It's the guy who you bake a cake for in Paper Mario. Oh man, this makes me want an ice cream sandwich. I've got more of that lunch and kingdom. Look at how many eggs those guys give you. I mean, it makes sense. Can't target those weird egg-shaped rocks. Yeah, oh, this is like a caramel-flavored ice cream sandwich. Salted caramel. Gotcha. Oh, they're blocking something. You see it down there? That little thing? Oh, you can't stomp them. You gotta eat them. Although I see high coins. Oh, that's cool. You can crawl? You couldn't do that before in other games, I don't think. Alright, let's see if we can flutter to these. Yeah. Oh, we're sinking on a marshmallow. <laughs> All right, let's go, chubby dude. Push down the sandwich. Whoops, I missed. I missed! Oh, okay. That was close. Uh-oh, these guys have the wrapper still on them. Surely we can't gobble them. Oh, look at all those coins. You know there's going to be something right up... Yep, I see the flower. And a nice wedding cake in the background. I like this stage. Look at that cake in the background, man! 
I'm hungry. Yes, this is the part of the trailer that you always saw Cupcake Yoshi in. This screen right here. Alright, let's... Oops, jump. Huh? I can't move. Poochie! He just came out of a cupcake. Okay, let's go meet up with him. Checkpoint. Let's go, Poochie. Run him over. Oh, I want the eggs, actually. Look at that donut in the background. And whatever that is. Okay. This is the part where it gets crazy. Riding on Poochie and having to look at the background, the foreground, and the midground. Alright, didn't miss anything. Boom. Oh, duck. Okay. There's a flower down there. Turn left. Yeah, I like this, how he puts it in his mouth. Just like the Wonder Wolves of Woolly World. Look out. What is this? Coins. Get a egg. Any red coins? Yes! Boom! <laughs> like that thwap noise every time. Huh? Oh, bye, Poochie. He looks so sad to be leaving, but yeah. Priorities first, Poochie. <laughs> Three cupcakes. That is definitely something. No red coins, but okay. Can you open this with an egg? It highlighted, you know it's something. Hmm. Although those are usually the things you jump up from underneath. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah. Haven't missed a flower yet. That's good. I see a present in the background. Nice. Getting used to the airborne throwing, too. Luckily, it kind of just defaults to straight ahead where Yoshi's looking, so... Uh-oh, I need eggs first before activating that. Poochie's back there, look at him go! What do we gotta do? Uh, find the happy one, it's right there. Okay. Oh no, hold on, we gotta get on, on top of that. From the tall ice cream sandwich. We're sinking! Uh-oh. I forgot we're on sinkable marshmallows. I'm assuming they're marshmallows. Alright. Anything hidden up here before I stomp these dudes? Oh, yeah. Got it. Okay. Can I do it again? Yes. It was like 1, 1, 1, 20. Boom. Wait, I'm running out of eggs. You can't be giving me all these clouds. Uh-oh. Gobble them away. Uh, I don't know if it's smart to gobble them all. There's something up here. Yeah. See? Gotta keep your eyes open for those little hidden things. Yeah, you definitely get a lot of coins, so it, I guess it is worth your time to use them on the costume machine. Still haven't missed a flower, that's good. We're doing good this stage. Um, you probably don't have to worry about whacking them. Although this one might be tricky. Okay, go back. Alright, so we'll get the last guy. I see a cupcake back there. It's wiggling. There's Poochie. Yes. And I got a chubby shy guy worth of eggs. All right, Poochie, what was by your cupcake, though? Oh, man. That's like a new home. There's probably somebody in the world who has a giant cupcake bed for their dog. 
there's a thing. The yellow wings is a collectible, right? Well, no, because the last time it was blue coins. Yeah, okay. Get ready. Okay, it's the apples again. Uh-oh. All right, that one was, seemed a little weird. Yeah, good job, Poochie. Get them through the cupcakes. But there's something on top of the cupcakes. You know that there is. Yes. All the red coins, and then we're missing a flower still. Keep your eye down at the bottom of the screen and the background. Wait, there it is! Whoa, yeah, good job. We got everything, right? Yeah. Let's go, Poochie, to the finish. Oh, look at that giant one. Wow, that was crazy. Yeah. That was a fun stage. I like it. Nice. The first 100% in a while. Probably since the first world. Still not able to get a costume. What's this next one? Yoshi pulls some strings. Only nine flowers in this one. Well, let's do it, because I want my cupcake costume. So I guess this is the pastel pathway video. I like that, though. I wonder if that means there's going to be more worlds overall than in Wooly World. Since each world only has like three stages or so. More themes, at least. Oh, cool! They brought this back! This is like the curtain level from Wooly World. Although it's missing that music. What's happening? Okay. Nothing hidden? There's something in here. Wow, I almost missed that. What are these little guys? What happens if you hit them? Well, they pop. I don't know if I was supposed to do that, though. No, they're back, so that's a sign that I need them. Okay, you bounce off them. But wait, what's to the left? Nothing. I'm being- I'm thinking too far ahead. Okay. Is this the way forward? Whoa! Didn't mean to do that. Uh, control sticks with platformers are weird sometimes. I much prefer a D-pad. But the Switch doesn't have a D-pad. I'm using the... Well, I guess it does. The Pro Controller does, right? I don't have one of those. I'm using the thing it comes with that you just put the Joy-Cons in. I forget what it's called. The shell. And that has buttons, like C buttons. What is that? It's gonna be blue coins, isn't it? Yep. Must go faster. Okay. Get over there. Oh, man. That was close. Yeah, that's flower number two, so I went the way forward instead of... I saw it, there was a big gap on the right there, but I went left, assuming, because usually in these platformers, left is where they hide the secrets, because right is the way to the goal. Yes, I love this thing. Oh, get the top one. Yeah. Not as good as the curtain level in Wooly World, but still pretty cool. I like that mechanic. Wait, there's all kinds of dead space down there. I have to check. Nope. There's a pigeon. Trying to hide there. There's something here, too. Two coins. Oh, once again, right or left? Right. Uh, 
I guess that's the hint we gotta use from now on. Wherever there's a path of coins is likely the way forward, the way that the game wants you to go, where there is not a secret. Whoops, whoa, I was just seeing what was down there. Excuse me. Uh, once again, although, no, see, that goes against what I just said. I don't know. It's the thing with these Yoshi games, you gotta check every nook and cranny. Like Thomas English Muffins. Whoa! Okay. Nice, I chose correctly. This is a confusing stage of which way to go for the secrets, and which way is the way forward. Well, let's just fall down this way, why not? Yeah, bypass the little spider dudes, although I feel like I may have missed something in doing so. A spring? Wait, there's gotta be more stuff down there. There was all kinds of dead space I walked by. Nope. It looks like a place they would hide a hidden cloud, but no. Anything over here? No. That's why I was debating about doing... After I finished my Woolly World Let's Play, I was gonna do another one, but play it much faster, because it was the same thing with these Yoshi games. Playing it blind, you kinda... Wander around a bunch, looking for stuff, but then once you know where everything is, you could play much faster, and it could be maybe more exciting. But I don't know. Like there, that's a great example. All that space that I don't have to check, apparently, but my first time through, why is it... Whoa! Ah, oh, there is something there. Two red coins, good thing. Well, that's interesting. Let's get some more eggs. There's another little bird. We can hit him, why not? Nope, once again, another a perfect... Oh, there it is, it's on the top. Alright, don't get hit, we've got the heart award. Oh, jeez. You know there's gonna be something hidden here. Oh, man! Or just a giant cardboard flap that comes down. Okay, get the clouds first before jumping. Yeah, it's very strange, because the way that the aiming is built... There's something up there! It's like, because of the way that the aiming controls... The entire experience is catered to more of an exploratory, yeah, exploratory thing that's slower paced, whereas Yoshi's Island and Woolly World had the fast cursor! I wasn't paying attention. Ah, oh, man, there goes the heart reward. Get that. Get it! Okay, that was close. Roll, go! Yep. Once again, I took a hit at the end. I gotta start wearing these costumes. It's just sometimes I like regular Yoshi. But yeah, like that instance where I was bouncing on the spring trying to hit those two clouds, it's a very slow, clunky thing in this game, whereas in previous Yoshi games, you could just quick do it. Just by the way that the aiming is very fast and catered towards like an action platformer. Whereas this is kind of, I don't know what it is. It's kind of action platformer, but kind of not really at the same time. Well, kind of butchered the level a little bit at the end. Oh yes, the cupcake! I must get the cupcake. There was a super rare cupcake, too. Look at all these coins. How many I have. We're putting in three. I don't care how much it costs. We just got three regular costumes. That's not good enough. A striped windmill. Blue yarn. And red yarn. That's not a cupcake. Um, let's do... One coin, right? Yeah, look at that super rare cupcake. The two cookies. That's another regular one. It has to be a red egg or that super golden one in there. It's a pink coffee creamer. 
We gotta bump it up, man. I don't care. <laughs> Look at all the coins we have. What else are we gonna spend a moment? There it is! That's the super rare costume! Look at how the lighting changed. Yeah, everybody's happy. Cupcake! That's not the one I was thinking of, though. I... And a squirrel log. I was hoping for the, um... Let's see what it looks like, at least. <laughs> it's still kind of neat, though. It suits Green Yoshi. Marked it as my favorite. But I'm gonna keep playing. There's Look, there's only two eggs in there. So we'll put in two coins. Or no, there's more than that. We got two rare ones. Is it the pink cupcake that I was hoping for this whole time? I didn't even know there was a green one. That's cool. It's a green... A mint macar macaroon... How do you say that cookie name? And there's the pink one! Yes! Okay, it's not even a cupcake. We must put it on. Which means maybe next time we're gonna play as Pink Yoshi. Yeah. These are definitely my favorite costume so far. <laughs> I don't know why. I think that one suits Green Yoshi best. Alright, well I think that's it for this episode. Next time we will move on and be a different Yoshi. So thanks for watching you guys. See you then.